Hi there, I'm Stuart Sink, and this is what's in my golf bag. Driver is such an important club today. I'm using the Nike uh, SQ, nine and a half degrees. It gives me unbelievable power. It's such a consistent ball fight that I don't really have to change my swing characteristics to get the ball to come up or go down in windy weather, for instance, or in, or in golf course that's hard and fast. For a big head, it's not a very deep face, and so um, I'm able to hit this thing off the fairway, which I use pretty regularly uh, if I need to get extra distance off the fairway. On my driver, I use a rib grip. It's got a reminder in the back, and it's the only grip that I use the reminder on. Just because I like to feel that rib in my fingers, I just feel like it gives me a better idea for the way the club's lined up. The irons in my bag are Nike CCI irons, except for the two, three, and four iron which you can see are a little bit more of a cavity back club and give me a little extra loft on the ball when I need it on these long irons. Took it straight up in the air, didn't he? Mark? He did, very high. Oh, baby. Down to the three wood, it's a 15 degree, very solid, easy to hit. I hit this about 270 off the tee, which is a pretty good club to have for a second driver. Maybe I need to hit a real big hook or, or uh, something or want to swing aggressively but can't run it out to 300. I go with the three wood off the tee pretty commonly. I've got the uh, latest Nike wedges. I like this, uh, the finish being uh, what they call the rusty finish or the, uh, it's unchromed. It doesn't have a layer of chrome on the outside. The chrome is the shiny metal that makes the, uh, the club durable and it gives it that beautiful look that just gleams on the store shelf. Well, it also makes it feel a little bit harder to me. So I ask them not to do that chrome layer. After about two or three weeks in the bag here, it starts to look ugly, like these do. They got good grooves on them, and um, six degrees of bounce on the 60 degree wedge here, 12 degrees of bounce on this 54 degree. Tracking right at the hole, and the consolation match comes to a dramatic conclusion. I changed to the Yes Lizzie putter uh, for the first time. Uh, I went with a putter that has offset on it. The last six or seven years, I've used a putter that has actually onset, which means the club face is ahead of the shaft. In this case, the putter's the face is behind the shaft. Helps me line the ball up a little bit better. This putter is designed to have close to zero degrees of lofts, and the, the grooves pick up the ball with the shape of your stroke. Rolls the ball good. Pockets are filled with all kinds of mess. If you uh, go in here, you can see uh, the trusty iPod car keys, chapstick, the old yardage book, which is a necessity for any player and caddy out here on tour. A couple of extra gloves, as always. I have a pair of socks. <laughs> I don't know really why these are in here, to be honest. My coach, Butch Harmon, hooks us up with these little pouches from time to time, and this one's an ostrich one. Houses all my markers. I'm one of the old holdouts that I still like to use these kind of markers right here with a little plastic nub on them, sort of like most of our grandmothers use. I get a lot of uh, grief out there on tour from that, but I'm an individual, what can I say?